What's up, everybody? Ramadan, Doc, Urban Spirit Dancer here. Finally here, bringing my moves to the world. Shout out to my man, Buddha Monk, for telling me to do this. Um, this step is going to be called the jump off. That's what I call it. Uh, I call it the jump off because it's a move that is going to jump off you. It's going to make you jump off. This is how you set yourself off. And this is how you do it in a small space. All right. I have two versions of it, which is the jump off. And then the second one, which I'll tell you when I start doing that. Um, and I'll give you a little history behind that as well. So the first move, the jump off, the purpose of it is dancing in a small space. That's why I'm in this small space today. Um, I, I like it because I came up with it under the intention of having to dance in a club. Um, when you take a class, the class doesn't really teach you how to dance in a club in a small space with a bunch of people around. So you have to figure out how to do that. So this dance is specifically made for a person that's an urban spirit dancer that's trying to get their energy off and that's trying to get off and jump off in a small place in a club where you don't have a circle or you don't have enough room to dance. You feel where I'm coming from? So this move is made for that. Here we go, the jump off. First, first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna start with whatever your dominant foot is, left or right. I'm right footed. So right dominant is gonna be, you're gonna start with a heel toe motion, right? Heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe. So now practice that for like three weeks because you got to like readjust your body so that you'll be comfortable doing heel toe. Some of you will pick it up sooner. Hey, if you do, that's cool. Heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe, heel toe. Now add your bounce. Heel toe. You're going to add a little rhythm to it. Heel toe. Heel toe rhythm, 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 heel toe rhythm. Now, the next step that you're gonna add to it is gonna be a hop. That hop is gonna be like a stomp. This is another sound. Your left foot or your your opposite foot is gonna be your bass. All right, add that to the heel toe. I love the Nicholas Brothers, I love tap dancing, I love Gregory Hines to my core. So this is kind of like something infused with them. Get that tap dance going. Heel toe tap, heel toe, 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 heel toe. Now people are gonna say, oh you look like you're jacking. No, jacking is this. totally different this heel toe is you can't <laughs> jacking is more is made for that it's a bigger movement this is made for small space so i can do this no matter how much room i got i can do this in the elevator right okay now i love that move <laughs> that's my favorite heel toe <laughs> okay now the second move that you're going to add to it is called the Harlem jump off. From the Bronx, went to high school in Harlem, love Harlem, barbershops, everything. All right. So my Harlem swag is all about the dice roll. That was my thing. Harlem dice roll. <clears throat> so now you're going to add the Harlem dice roll to your heel toe. All right. Boom. The heel toe bounce with the dice roll ready dice roll 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 got it 
jump off. Harlem jump off. Now, here's your variation. I want you to take your jump off and start adding to it. All right? This is what the add to the jump off is going to look like. Because it's a rhythm, because it's a rhythm, you can change the rhythm according to the music that you're dancing to. So listen to the music and interpret it and keep that rhythm and you can flip it. All right. So you hear how I sound? It's like doom doom da da doom doom da da doom doom da da. It can change to doom doom da da doom ah doom doom da da doom. Feel what I mean? So it's a rhythm. It's a solid rhythm. So all your cardio, everything is being worked. Your lower body is being exploded because as long as you keep that bounce going with the heel toe motion, you're using all of this, your lower half. That core is getting tighter. All right, you're adding this, this movement up top. Your shoulders, your upper body are getting a workout. You don't even realize it because as you're pushing yourself, this motion is making you work yourself. All right, so you're burning. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just go into the music. I'm not gonna keep teaching you steps. Remember, that's your jump off. That is the jump off. That's your Harlem jump off. That's the jump off. That means that it is your jump off step. You learn this, master it so that you can set off everything else that you are doing everything else that's creatively exploding inside of you all of that can be done when you start with that step and it'll give you the burn it'll give you that sweat that you need before you, you become explosive you feel what i mean before you go into whatever step you may do and before you have enough space to do it because it is going to allow you to respect everybody else around you as well. So remember, this jump off step isn't made so that you can be the life of the party and look upon. No, it's not about you. This jump off step is about the people around you as well. It's inclusive so that when you're doing it, you don't disrupt anybody else's heart. I'm going to play a couple of different songs so that you can see how to do this dance on different levels. So get ready. Here it is.
Just get on. 